episode of Elite Dodgeball. Today we have for you the North Region Series Round 3. Round 3 of the Losers Bracket. The number 1 seed Bear Jordan versus the number 5 seed DePaul Dodgeball. I'm your host Benny. With me as always my co-host Glenn. As we are ready and set for some dodgeball. And here we go. Both teams off to take the break. Burden ball on DePaul's side. How was it with the yellow burden? Both teams know what's on the line right here. This match pretty much determines who's moving on to the championship. And uh, Bear Jordan, they got knocked out by DePaul earlier in the winner's bracket, so they're probably going to be bringing it. Quick throw miss, Burden now on Bear Jordan's side. Meyer throws a Calvin Calvin, retaliates, just misses. But a good throw there gets Howitzer on the far side of the screen. Now Burden back, still rolling back to Bear Jordan's side. Now it switches over to DePaul as DePaul collects the ball, is looking to push up. Their team holding the front line, making some throws. Oh, Brian throws alone at Paul. You can't do that. He just catches it right there. Oh, and Trippetti taking it in his own hands right now. Going back and forth to Paul, hanging back. They got two players, but a full team of Bears. Yeah, Bear Jordan's looking very overpowering right now. The Paul just hanging in there. They're trying to collect the ball. They have Burden, but now just went back. Paul trying to go for the catch there. Trippetti stepping up now. The quick throw. Hit Shug right off the chest and on the far side. Wow, just like that. Game one goes to Bear Jordan. Took it really fast right there. Making it on the catches right there. Normally you don't really see that with Bear Jordan. They, uh, they slow the pace down, but they just wanted to end it quick, it seemed like. All right, game two, going to get set, get, get ready to go, and we're off for some dodgeball. Pitch is made really fast. Oh, Kevin really fast. Hits Evan Bryan. Kevin's really good at getting back behind the attack line. Very effective in doing that. Oh, Dylan threw, but Howitzer with the momentum catch. Yep, he fell out of bounds but kept his feet in while he caught it, so catch counts and he's still in. A couple counterattacks there are pairs looking now. We're even team, 4-4. Four, four. Burden on DePaul's side. Rachel pushing up on the close side of the screen. You gotta watch out for her. Yeah, she's uh, always looking for players that aren't looking. Ooh, Ziggy and Howard's are through, got Paul. Oh, but then the counterattack forces him to dodge out of bounds. Howard just fell out there. Rachel, nice sneak attack on Kevin. Jimmy throwing, and oh, get Ziggy to dodge out of bounds. DePaul's just beating themselves right now, falling out of bounds. It's a three and two. Bear Jordan has the player and the ball advantage. Evan Bryan on the far side trying to square up, pumping, holding his own, and a good nice dodge there. Not able to save any balls, though. Rachel looking to get one. Yeah, but he's not wasting his ball. He knows uh, how important ball control is. Right now, Burden still on Bear Jordan's side. Now just swings to DePaul, DePaul pushing up. Brian with a quick throw, Jimmy just misses, a nice dash to the side. Rachel trying to get the counterattack, just gets hit, and Jimmy, oh. oh! The sweetness! Diving catch, but he caught it before Howitzer caught his ball. That was Brian, Brian caught the other or, ball. Yep, before Brian caught his ball. And Bear Jordan takes it in two, just busting out the sweep there. Getting some nice revenge. Bear Jordan moving on to the championship. This has been an episode of Elite Dodgeball. Please like and subscribe to our YouTube page. Follow us on Twitter, like our Facebook page, look up our new app, or for more videos and dodgeball information, visit www.elitedodgeball.com.